Yasuo, but unlucky that I have people like this, dude. out of there all right guys uh so number one i'd like to apologize uh, i kind of went silent on a few parts uh, just because i was tilted uh ariana took my lane i was first pick i got yasuo but apparently she locked ariana uh she went mid she refused to cooperate uh anyway i had a free commentary on how to play against annie but apparently i played against lisa and abram so anyway hope you enjoyed the video hope you learned how to play uh, against two champions at once uh peace out enjoy the video hope you learned something from it and uh yeah, pretty much. Uh, for this one, I'm just going to go with Lady of the Ring King as the first item. Uh, regardless. So, Ariana's briefing at the moment. Please retreat. Ariana, please leave the lane. Can you leave, please? I'm just going to try to walk this way. I don't want to get stunned. Uh, no, you don't. Uh, I apologize guys, I actually got tilted because of this Oriana because I didn't realize she locked Oriana before. Uh, I was first pick and had Yasuo, but unlucky that I have people like this, dude. Uh, in any case, uh, I don't even know how to explain the what I did there. I just saw Zinja coming to me. So I kind of like baited them into coming to me. Uh, pretty much level 3 is... usually Look, usually every champion has a power spike. And most of them actually are level 3. So for me, when I saw that Zinja was coming. And Zinja was one of the most uh, OP junglers right now. If you guys are interested in playing uh, such champion. Uh, in any case, I saw that uh, Zinja was coming. Uh, Lee Sin practically missed his Q. So all I had to do was play around the minions. Make him miss the Q. Same goes for Braum. He missed his Q. And we got the double kill over there. Game is not that hard. Uh, honestly, you just need to learn the mechanics, macro, micro, all the kind of stuff. So macro is when you focus around uh, the map and objectives in general. Uh, hold up. Uh, macro and micro. So macro is when you focus around the objectives and the map in general, how you play around the map. And uh, when it comes to... Is this guy for real? Okay, uh, when it comes to mechanics, it's basically micro, so how you control the champion and stuff like that. So it's not that difficult to play the champion, uh, all in all. It's actually very, uh, very playable, actually. Uh, Yasuo's a little bit easier on mobile than he is on uh, PC. I used to meet him, I think I have like 700k points uh, accumulated across three accounts, I think. Or maybe 800k, I think. Some stuff like that. I'm just going to wait uh, until my uh, flash is back up. Or I have uh, Zen Zhao around me. Uh, I'm not really interested in... Uh, not really interested in fighting this. and then Unless I have my flash. Uh, knowing that I'm safe. I think Braum just recalled right there. So I'm just going to push as fast as possible. I wind wall back. And this is something I really need to ask the developers about. I don't understand how some of the keys are actually very sensitive. I guess uh, it's just like when you when you click on the third skill, the second skill get casted, and if you get uh, if you press the second skill, it's either the first or the second uh, or the third getting uh, casted. It's just like a kind kind of awkward uh, mechanic in the game. I guess you can say uh, kind of needs a fixing, or maybe you could just like space out uh, the abilities from each other a little bit. Um, I know there isn't much space on this phone. It's the Samsung Galaxy A50, but yeah, it's not that bad. 
I'm okay with that. He used his Q. This is where I go in. Yeah, I hit him. He was gonna kick me there, so... Might as well be safe. So the way I played it there is because I'm I was almost positive that he was gonna Okay. So the way I played it there is because I'm I was pretty sure he was gonna flash and kick me. So I tried to stay away from him as much as possible. Uh the way you wanna play the lane against Lee Sin is he has a free W, honestly. He does not need to ward. You're not sure when he's going to W, so all you have to do is just, like, avoid uh, getting kicked into the tower. And you're good to go that way. Uh, usually I would recall, but I have no reason to recall right now. Even though it would be good for me, though. Uh, but I prefer to stay just for now. Uh, because the wave is going to hit the uh, going to hit mid right now. So, And also I have almost three levels of elite. Hmm, okay. Uh, he used all of his abilities there. I'm not really interested in staying now, so I'm just going to recall. Uh, practically, the build that I want to go is PD, so I would go with some extra crit right here. Uh, since I have Blade of the Ruin King, I'm pretty safe. I'm just going to use my boots to get the lane a little bit faster. I don't need it uh, to run away or anything like that, simply because uh, whenever you use the boots, if you take damage or if you deal damage, then... Oh, wait. Uh, simply if you deal damage or take damage, then you lose the movement speed, so it's pretty much useless. There we go. So, uh, yeah, pretty self-explanatory, actually. He's, he's not that... He's, he is mechanically challenging, kind of, sort of, but not as much as people think. Maybe because I'm kind of comfortable playing him, I guess. But yeah. Uh, overall, laning phase is very strong. As long as you avoid ganks and all that kind of good stuff, then you're good to go. I'm gonna push the lane here, nobody can stop me, and if you, even if they try to, I can just fight him. Alright. She used both abilities here, which means I could try to... Oh, I didn't know my ult. Kind of miscalculated that. Uh, doesn't matter, she still dies. If she stays, she dies. No, oh, nice. I can get the tower here. Love how this Zinja is playing towards my side. Always love seeing a jungler playing my side. Anyway. I was gonna try to show you guys that you can dash over the wall. This is a guy that I'll be doing on... Uh, some other video. Uh, it's a pretty self-explanatory video, actually, but I'm gonna leave it for some other time. Meantime, enjoy just uh, the video, and hopefully you guys learn something from his gameplay, basically. Please let me get it. Okay, thank you. I'm just gonna recall. Alright, cool. Uh, I usually would go QSS here, but Extra damage is nice, plus Mercury Treads usually give me tenacity anyway, so I'll just stick to Mercury Treads for now. Uh, the way I want to play this game for now is, since I have a very huge lead against every single one of them, as you can see I have double the gold. Uh, practically, I just want to push as much as I can and try to... Don't make disgrace, what? Okay, uh, whatever. <laughs> What do you mean to make this grace? Oh, hello. Oh, 
Oh dear lord. He's gone. Come on, dude. Come on! I thought he was here! No way! I was a little bit greedy there, though. So, that was my fault. Okay, never mind. It doesn't work. Okay, I don't understand how my wind wall is not working against the Gromp, but whatever. Uh, gonna summon the Herald here. I'm gonna try to get them to come to my side. I'm gonna stay regardless, so... Yeah, it's a... Uh, it's a wrap from this... Alright, you missed big time. You missed big time, my dude. Okay, I messed up the dash. I wanted to dash to the top minion. Apparently, I dashed to the one on the right, but that's cool. It doesn't matter. I probably want to go more damage, to be honest. I don't need the uh, extra health, I'm assuming. I would maybe go for... Yeah, I'm going to go Bloodthirster for this one. Bloodthirster is really good. It's a little bit of a safer item, I guess. Uh, it gives you a shield on top of the shield that you have. And uh, overall, it's a good item for a fight. The 14 fights, I mean. Yeah, this game is uh, heavily dominated right now. I apologize, guys. I know a lot of my videos are like games being highly dominated. Uh, I guess I just, uh, I guess I just need to upload a game where I'm actually kind of on the losing side. Probably gonna try to play a few more games and try to get the uh, try to get a game where I'm sort of behind. But as I said, hopefully you guys enjoyed this game. So hopefully you learned something as well. Ooh, I almost had her there. Almost had her there. That was a 1v4 and then my team came to help. Love how my team rotated. Kind of loving this game. Damn. Anyway. Unfortunately. <laughs> Why the poor guy? Oh, okay, never mind. He's not a poor guy. He's 6 What are you doing? Okay, yeah, he's, uh, I don't know if he's lagging or he's just throwing the game at this point. He's just, like, not aiming his ability at, at us, basically. Okay, so they surrendered. Alright, so GG, guys. Uh, as I said, uh, if you guys enjoy this type of content where I play a uh, full gameplay uh, game... Oh, sorry, full game? Why can't I... Dude, I swear to God, I can't uh, speak in general nowadays. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe, and share. Let me know what you think of the video as well. Uh, if you guys uh, want to watch more uh, gameplay content uh, in general, uh, please uh, leave a like. 20, like, uh, 20 likes is the goal. Uh, if you guys are uh, also interested in some sort of uh, maybe a guide to some of the champions instead of just the full gameplay, uh, please let me know in the comment section below as well. And yeah, that would be it. There's also a Discord uh, server that you can join. You can also follow me on Twitter for the updates of the videos and stuff like that. You can also contact me there. I reply to every comment. I reply to every tweet. Uh, I'm, I'm only but a small YouTuber, you know what I mean? So uh, just like, come on, help your boy out. Let's see how we can get, uh, let's see how many likes we can get. Let's see how many subscribers we can get. Let's see how many new viewers uh, we can get in these videos. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out, people.